out and I'll bring you your money. No, I'm not now. I'm not giving you anything where you're at. I can assure you. I'll call the cops on you then. I swear to God. Okay, you ahead. stupid. Oh, I don't. Nobody should have to go through something like that. Let's put up the picture full of masks. I don't have all of the details. I would like more details. If someone has more detail than I currently have, please send it to indisputable. So the argument according to what we're able to hear is about a return and a reimbursement. She wants her money back, which I guarantee you is within misdemeanor territory, all right? We're not talking about felony money. We're talking about misdemeanor money. She wants her money back. The woman does not deny her. She does not say, no, I'm not giving you your money back. She says, I will bring it out to you. Uh, but I'm not going to do anything with you acting this way. Now, why did she say this? She said this because at this point, the individual uh, is no longer welcome inside of the facility. Now it's trespass. She has to leave. She has to walk out. But the woman is willing to go the extra mile, give her her refund, take it outside to her, to hand it to her directly so that the aggression is isolated away from the facility. This is a right that individuals have working inside a restaurant, period. They have the right to say, you're being aggressive. You're causing a scene and we're going to give you your money back. You're going to have to step outside for this to happen. No problem. The way this woman was acting toward um, the restaurant employee, completely insane. So she then decides to physically assault this lady. I mean, to just slap this. Put up the picture again. Put it up again. She slaps the woman, turns around as if she has done nothing. Proceeds to get into her car. That's called. A getaway. I have to imagine that the Karen in question here, and we'll keep that picture up, that the Karen in question did not get to this point in her life by going around slapping everybody. She slaps people selectively. And in her estimation, the person in front of her is worthy of her slapping the individual. And I wonder why that exists. Could it be because she's decided to perceive the individual as less than, as not equal, as different? Because, well, it's a person working at a fast food restaurant getting on my nerve. It's a very sad thing. And I know the employees, they were trying to hold the manager back. Um, I would not have held a damn thing back, all right? I would have never held that manager back. That manager had the right to proceed in order to stop the individual from leaving uh, until the authorities arrived. They had the right to do so. And I would have never assumed she was going to do anything other than that, okay? But these things happen, they should not happen. I want to echo, um, I used to work uh, in fast food restaurants, worked in multiple fast food restaurants. It's the most difficult job on the planet. You're on your feet all day. It's constant work. You're underpaid, underappreciated typically. And you have to deal with people like that. So I want to take this moment to say thank you to everyone who serves us, gives us food, who puts a smile on their face, who says, may I help you? Even though you could never imagine what kind of problems, challenges they're facing at home. This never should have happened, all right? We'll appreciate uh, whoever recorded this and submitted it.